Greetings programs! I'm Young Napoleon and I want to welcome you back to my Victoria 3 Let's Play series. This is episode 15 of a Swedish learning to play run with no mods and none of the DLC. Uh, in the last episode we were kind of exploring some colonial options, more colonial options here in Africa. It's well before the quote-unquote scramble for Africa. Um, and I'm just kind of getting some footholds here in territories where I can. Uh, I wonder if there's another technology that's going to happen in the 1870s <clears throat> that's going to make these a bit more enticing. I don't know. Severe malaria. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, we're shooting for Igbo right here. We can get our hands on on that. Would be kind of cool. Uh, in the meantime, we're going to unpause and let things unwind. 19 of 19. Why does this number, that's the second number keep changing. That's what I want to know. Is there a number that I can... No, we do not want to remove that. That, how can I see if my interest is built up yet? Right, because I've got an interest in Niger. Niger interest activated. Okay, cool, cool. Right, and then we're also working on... Uh-oh. Chile is encroaching. Actually, they're not. There, it looks like they're. That's fine. They can have this region as long as they let me have. As long as they leave this one alone. It's hard to tell. All right, uh, and I think once this lead mine gets built up, uh, you can see my principal is really high. I think I need to uh, cool it there for a little bit. Expensive government goods, yeah. Isolated, Swedish, Niger, Deltas, oh yeah. Should build a port. Let's make sure they don't already have one. Before I go building one of my own, I don't think so. No. Uh, let's see. I don't think I have any infrastructure here yet, do I? Oh, no, I do. Okay. So we'll build the port. And then... Go ahead and crank up the speed a little bit. And then they won't be isolated. 
And then we'll just kind of coast for a bit. And let this red bar go down. Uh, we've got some unproductive trade routes. That's fine. I forgot to go research that. Maybe I'll do that after this episode now. Let's take a note. Research. Unproductive. Trade routes. Okay. Standard of living's going up. That's nice. So it looks like the price of lead's gone up. Explosives have gone up. Ammunition's gone down. That's good. Rifling. Very good. Apparently I have a conscription center now. I don't know how that happened. Baking powder unlock. Cool, cool. Oh, uh, food industries. Good, good. Sokoto, improving relations. Ah, Sokoto. Good old Sokoto. You guys remember Sokoto, right? The, uh... The, the standard target in Victoria 2, everybody's favorite target to pick on. Okay. Explosives and price of engines have gone up. I, I do not know how that got built. Maybe I took over the area that had it? Ah. Uh, something just happened. Oh yeah, rifling. Oh, hello. Raising concerns. What's going on? Armed forces have expressed their concern. Let's see the armed forces. Stop. They I lose approval and they lose political strength. Come on. Okay, so let's see. They are at five, so I would lose a this this uh, reduction in the military technology cost. I'm not researching anything right now, so that's not a huge. And it's only for five years. Whereas if I go this way, I would lose two from the industrialists. And I really want to keep the industrialists happy. Uh, it would be really nice to get this job creators. Well, or would it? I don't know if I have too many capitalists right now. But that production technology cost is kind of nice. Actually, I don't know if I'm... Yeah, I'm using... I'm getting a society technology right now, so either one doesn't matter. But... We'll go with that. Uh, and inefficient agriculture. We should follow their advice. We get a... Migration attraction to Swedish Niger Delta for the industrialists. We should definitely follow their advice. I don't think there are any upper strata pops in Swedish Niger Delta. 
to begin with. I gotta be careful that I don't mispronounce that. Uh, let's see. Ooh. Okay. Enact protectionism, huh? There's some support for that. I'm at mercantilism, which does what? 15% uh, tariffs on imports, 5 on exports. 10% tariffs on exports. And 30% tariffs on imports. Oh, th those are the difference. Okay. I see. Whereas this one, the tariffs would go up on exports and would go down on imports. So that would... It would make I would, I would make more money on stuff that I exported, and less money on stuff that I'm importing. Which means the stuff that I'm importing would be cheaper, which means it would be good for people trying to buy stuff that I'm importing. Which if I'm importing it, I want them to have it for basic needs and whatnot. Whereas the exports stuff that other people are yeah you know what let's go with protectionism i guess well no more people want it more people don't want it than do well more people want this than they want mercantilism the industrialists oppose and the rural folk want it. Oh, and the trade unions want it as well. Ooh, no, I don't want to piss off the industrialists that much. Uh, the, the U.S. just um, established a colony somewhere. Are they... No. For a second, I was afraid they might be encroaching it's down here. I'm gonna look at the region, not the Ooh, gold fields. What? Why can why am I not establishing a colony here? Oh, I see. I'd be Alright, the gold field would be nice. Uh, for now, we're going to focus on finishing this up before we move into... Silk now. Maybe. I don't know. State in Great Britain. <clears throat> They've incorporated? The South Atlantic Islands? Wow. Oh, no, they haven't. Okay. Ah. Okay. Uh, should I or shouldn't I? Let's, uh, let's wait until that. Oh, I wonder if these are currents, probably. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. I want to wait until I finish off uh, Igbo. I don't want to spread myself around too much. Increasing the speed a little bit here. Oh, hey, Sierra Leone. That's something you hear about a lot. Swedish Gambia. Oh, did I get Swedish Gambia? How about that? Eh, 
not a whole lot here. Uh, let's see. Do they have, they just got some malaria. This might have been a mistake, but hey. Sugar or cotton? Let's get some cotton into the market, shall we? No, I didn't even look to see. Yeah, okay. I should be fine. It didn't even hurt my... Oh, right, because I've got the investment pool built up a little bit. Labor movement unlocked. Plus one minimum expected standard of living. Nationalism is spreading. That's cool. Max workplace safety office institution investment. Uh, breeding and education. Disagreements between the landowners and intelligentsia. I don't think I want to... Yeah, that'd be kind of nice. Uh, let's see. I don't really care about the landowners. Do I? I'm not really using my influence all that much. Or I could lose some authority for... It's only for five years, and I'm not using up a whole lot of it right now. These sound effects. Uh, let's see. Eh. I would lose the family ties. Yeah, I'd rather lose, I think, family ties. Let's go ahead and get that out of the way. Uh, that's fine. Because I'm not really using that much anyways. Oh, Denmark is trying to, but the UK is button in. Where's mine? Here we go. Igbo. Central Archives. All right. This is what I needed. What does that do for me? It, it allows me to, yeah, yeah. Okay. So first things first, I want to come over here to buildings. Excuse me. And where are my... Maybe it's in development. Urban? My government administration? Here it is. Okay. Let me switch you to standardized. We're going to use a lot more paper. But we're going to get a metric ton of bureaucracy but we really need to at this point um press papers oh yeah let's see here okay mutual funds oh it lets me switch to publicly traded stuff Plus 10% minting. I take five years though. Yeesh. Any stragglers up in the society tab? Socialism, five years. Nationalism is spreading to me. Gives me some additional authority. Authorita. Not military. Anything strag any stragglers here? We definitely don't want to get behind in the in this territory, in this region. Repeaters, three years. Breach loading artillery. Uh, 
and production. Oh, there's dynamite. Four years for dynamite. <clears throat> Excuse me. Bessemer process, 25 months. Makes more steel, use, uses more coal and iron. I really want the dynamite, though. Let's go for dynamite. Let's unpause while I look at this stuff. Actually, let's go ahead and pause that back because this is a good point to stop it for the day. I hope you guys have enjoyed this as much as I have. If you have, please be sure to do all that YouTube stuff. As always, I would take it as a kindness. And remember, sometimes you win and sometimes you learn. I hope we've all learned something today. And I will see you guys next time.